Welcome to my channel and today we will be learning how to create a Gantt chart in Excel or you can also term it as a timeline chart. Uh, so if it is uh, basically used in a project so if you are driving a project you want to see what are the timelines for different aspect of the projects you can design a Gantt chart and use it. So similarly I've used an example here uh, this is the project is creation of a house so uh, there are several steps which needs to be done so like basement digging structure roof and the ground floor first floor second floor so there are uh, there are start dates and the days it will take to complete the activity so we need to plot this into a gantt chart like this as i've already done here so i'll tell you how we can do it so let me i've copied the data onto the another sheet we'll start working on it and create the gantt chart so first what we'll do is we'll go to insert and we'll insert a bar graph, a horizontal uh, bar graph, like stacked bar. So we can, we'll do it a 3D one. I'll click on this. I don't need to show the data right now, so I'll delete the data. Okay, so we need a blank chart here. So we'll right click, we'll go on to select data, we'll add an entry, okay, edit series, it says the name of the series is start date, so I'll click here, series value, we'll remove the default values and select the dates here, okay, and we'll add another legend here, series name is days to complete series value I'll just remove it and select this and click on ok uh, one two three four which is appearing here in the horizontal index so we need to select the projects the different uh, steps in the project so I'll just select this here and I'll click on ok I'll click on ok if you see here the uh, aspects which are appearing here the uh, the different phases these are opposite so basement digging should come first and then basement structure and all so we'll adjust that how we can do that we'll select the we'll select this and we'll do a right click go to format access and okay once we have the format access we'll checkbox this option which says categories in reverse order once we do it it appears here and uh, all the activities have lined in the right uh, order we wanted now we only want the uh, first of all we see the dates which are appearing here it's starting from 1st of December till 9th of May however our project is starting from 31st of January so we will adjust this I'll just copy this date and paste it here I'll convert this to number I'll tell you why so once we convert to number you see Excel stores date in number format so we need to use this number to start this uh, index that we have the scale so we'll click on the scale right click and go on to format access once we have this window we will update the minimum value 43800 which is appearing here to this so we need to update it as 43861 so 43861 okay I'll do a tab you see now our project starts on 31st of January which is the start date here well we need to uh, remove the blue bars which are appearing here so I'll just click on the blue bars and I will go on to fill and then no fill right so and then we can select different formats for this chart so I've uh, used this black one so once you select the format it automatically uh, the blue bars appear again so you need to click on the blue bar and remove the color here and click on no fill so this is basically how you create a Gantt chart 
and if you like this video and you have learned something please like share and subscribe to my channel thank you